What's up everyone, my name is Alex Kouras and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be giving myself the perfect beard trim and I'm gonna be showing you guys two different beard examples just so you have an idea of what you can play with. And so the tools I'm gonna to be using for this beard trim are gonna be these grooming scissors, which are probably like $5, this little brush that was only a few dollars as well, the wall trimmer with the T-blade attachment, and then these cordless clippers by Kemi. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the beard trim. So the first thing I'm gonna do is grab my scissors and I'm just gonna create a straight line right along my beard here and get any of the hairs that are above the beard. Mainly the first step I'm gonna be doing is just edging up the upper portion of the beard and then afterward getting all the hair on my neck to really give it a really nice shape. And some of you guys might be wondering why I use the grooming scissors over the trimmer to get the cheeks. And honestly, I just like using the scissors because it's probably a little bit more safer and it gives me a more precise cut because this isn't zero gapped and I can use the edges of the scissor to get really close to the root of the hair. So really it's just personal preference. And so now I'm gonna go in and clean up the hairs on my neck to really just make it more cleaner and make the lines much more sharper underneath my beard. All right, so we're not looking too bad. I've got my cheeks all cleaned up right in here. And then underneath my neck, it's pretty clean. But if you wanna take it one step further, you can throw on the attachment for the foil shaver. Just take off the T-blade, put the foil shaver on as the attachment and clean up all of the excess hair underneath your neck or underneath your beard and on your cheeks as well. So real quick, let me just go ahead and clean up the hairs on my neck and my cheeks with the foil shaver attachment. All right, you guys, so this is the beard. I've done the cheeks, I've done the neck. This is how it looks so far. This is gonna be as clean as you can get it, so if you guys wanna keep this beard, you can stop right now. Otherwise, I'm gonna be using my hair clippers to pretty much just take all of this down and give it my usual beard look. So let's get right to it. For the first step to trim up my beard, I'm gonna be using the no guard with the lever completely closed, and I'm just gonna go in and remove all of the hair up to about my mustache on both sides. Now using the number two guard with the lever completely open, go in and clear up all of this bulk. So now I'm gonna go back in with the no guard and the lever completely closed to clean up the bottom half of my neck and give it more of a round shape. Now using the no guard with the lever completely open, give yourself about a quarter of an inch of a guideline all the way around on the ends. Now using the number one guard with the lever completely open, go ahead and give yourself about a half inch guideline all the way around. Close the lever completely and then just soften up the hard line all the way around. Now using the half guard with the lever completely closed, go in and clean up this hard line.
For the last step, you want to put on the one and a half guard with the lever completely closed to knock out this final hard line. All right, you guys, so I'm almost done, but I'm gonna go in and fix up my sideburns to pretty much match the length with the hair on my sides to the length on my beard. So now that these sideburns are blended, I'm gonna go in with my trimmer once more with the T-blade and flick out this hard line. All right, you guys, so I'm all done with the beard trim. Let me go ahead and show you the final look. Alright you guys, so if you did like today's video, make sure you leave a like and share this video with a friend. And also, if you're new to my channel, make sure you guys click on that subscribe button down below and click on the post notifications as well to never miss a new weekly video. And don't forget to check out my self haircut course if you want to learn in much more detail how to give yourself fresh self haircuts to save yourself time and money every single other week. I'll leave the course linked in the description down below and in the card section above. But I hope you guys found value in today's video. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.